part of putting people at ease, I think, is creating an environment where they feel at ease rather than feeling like they've stepped into uh, a medical office or a medical facility. When you first walk in, it feels comfortable. It feels like someone's home. You walk into the reception area. The lighting isn't harsh, it's very soft, and the, the furnishings are very relaxed and inviting. The most important part is when you introduce yourself that you try and get to know them and present yourself as a human being, as a person, rather than a physician. One of the reasons that I chose Dr. Fortes is because number one was his credentials, but then once I came in and interviewed with him and discussed what the process would entail, he just made me feel comfortable. Dr. Fortes makes me feel great about how I look. He's realistic. He has a sense of humor that makes you feel relaxed and comfortable when you're talking to him. He's not stiff or rigid as far as personality goes. Here's my approach. I think that every patient that walks in has a specific thing that bothers them. And so the conversation really has to center around them. I have to find out Number one, why they want to make a change. And then once I hear the specifics of why they want to make a change, then of course I will examine them. And from that point forward, then come up with a plan or a series of plans and to see which, which plan most fits their wishes. Like I felt really comfortable with him, mm -hmm. which it's hard for me to do that with a doctor. Once I was able to talk with him and he just listened and I just felt really comfortable of that he was attentive of what I wanted. I think plastic surgery above any other medical profession is by far the most creative one that there is. And I knew many years ago in order for me to be successful in any kind of job that I did it had to be something that really created a passion in me for it. It became clear to me that I had to do something that sort of was a combination of the technical things that I was learning and all the artistic impulses that I had in, inside me. So I think it was a natural fit and a perfect fit for me. I, I don't, can't imagine doing anything other than what I do.